Hey, this is Dave with DD Performance Research, and welcome back to the MR2 Square project. We are going to be talking a little bit about the engine bay today and the changes that have happened since the last time we uh, featured it. So obviously you can see we've got the uh, GT300 Monocraft replica kit from Luxury Part on there. We're gonna be making some significant changes to the back of it. We are gonna have a diffuser and the exhaust will probably be coming out somewhere considerably higher in the uh, chassis than where it normally does at the bottom, but that's still under discussion. So stylistic choices yet to be made there. Um, what we do see here that's quite different from last time, as you can see, we have a ton of DEI reflected gold in the engine bay. And the reason for this is the front side of that engine does have a turbo manifold on it that gets quite warm. The turbo manifold does have quite a bit of heat shielding on it. It uses the uh, heat shield products inferno wrap as the first layer. Well, actually technically it has a polydyne uh, ceramic coating as the first layer. After the ceramic coating, it's got inferno wrap and then on top of the inferno wrap is header armor. So it takes that manifold temp down from 1200 degrees or 1100 degrees and knocks it down to about 300 on the surface of it. And this reflective heat barrier will help keep that, that heat from going into the firewall and into the cabin and we'll just keep it in the engine bay. And then we'll be bringing fresh area uh, fresh air, I should say, in from that scoop side scoop over there. So that is the newest addition to our engine bay, and uh, it does have the benefit of looking really cool. Thanks for joining us, and this has been Dave from Data Performance Research, and this is the MR2 Squared Project.